Universal Tower Defense, the supposed anime adventures copy and paste. Now, this is just a testing phase, so I'm gonna just try out the game, see what it's about. I'm gonna be Keith Lee with the reviews, so don't worry, I'm gonna be 100% honest. Uh, I won't glaze. I'm gonna just say what I think. And if you guys don't like my opinion, well, I can't help you with that. All right, starting off with the trait roll menu, it looks pretty good. I mean, I have no, oh wait, I do have a unit, Jinglu. Okay. Okay, I could reroll a bunch of times, so let's just do that real quick. All right, what is this question mark? Oh, so this is all the traits you could get. All right, see, it's kind of a copy of AA here, because look, this these look like AA symbols, but like, or like the AA traits, but like just a bit tweaked. So, I mean, all right, I'll give them that. I mean, Eterno is something I, did, I didn't see before, so. So yeah, let's see, let's reroll now. All right, let's reroll until we get something, at least something decent. Oh my god, okay. Okay, at least it tells you that I'm that you're rolling off of a mythical. Let's just say that we're rolling off a mythical. At least it tells you before you do it. In AA, you would have just skipped that and it would have just like taken off your, your tray. Uh yeah, I mean golden that's probably not a good way. Hold up. I don't even know if What is she? Is she, is she in like an attack unit? Alright, I'm gonna keep it rolling because I don't even know if it's good on her. What did I get? Wizard? What is wizard? What does wizard do? Does it tell you? Uh. Okay. Even the sound effects. They even have stats. Bro, okay. <laughs> Alright. I don't know exactly what wizard does. Alright. I cannot find what it does. But. Alright. So far for the rerolls. I, I give it a 7 out of 10. I mean, it's straight off like copying AA in, in a way. But it has its own personal things. That is like different from a but kind of the same the sound effects and everything else is the same but um yeah seven out of ten it's decent all right now we're gonna go to the summoning now the summoning is definitely different from aa like the thing looks completely different i mean it looks like a regular banner right so i only have 500 gems so i'm gonna go do some off stream grinding or off recording grinding i guess and i'll be right back <clears throat> okay i'm back so you know i just did a bit of grinding you know just just a quick million uh but it doesn't say what the mythical is, so we're just gonna have to like keep summoning until we find out. So yeah, let's go let's See how it looks. Okay. This is straight off like AA All right, Naruto Oh my god, what the hell Fast car, I'm guessing that speed car. Okay, this is straight up just AA summon like the animation is straight up like like AA Oh, wait, wait, you got Jokey. Wait, we got a Mythic. Hold up. Okay, that sound effect was different. Okay, hold up, hold up. I gotta check that out. Hold up. Jokey. We got Jokey here. Uh, okay, so he has, like, no skin at all. Look, the sound is different. Uh, no skin at all. I don't know who Jokey is. Uh, or what an anime character is trying to be. W, I guess. Alright, we also have the quest menu. It looks pretty cool. I mean, looks, like, looks slick. It looks good. Now we have the evolve thing. So who do, can we evolve Johi? Oh, we need 10 runes B rank. Who is Johi? <laughs> All right. Now for the most important thing, the gameplay. We're going to hop in a quick game, see how it is. And if it's good, I'll let you guys know. By the way, uh, for summoning, I give it like a 6 out of 10. I mean, it's straight off AA. So, I mean, it is what it is. So, yeah, let's go. Let's go. Okay. Let's go. Uh, oh wait is it because i don't have units in i probably hold up. yeah i think it's because i didn't have units wait what <laughs> oh yeah it's because i didn't have units oh my god i'm so dumb i'm actually so stupid let's go let's do hard i have a unique on me so i got this no uh well we got rimuru i got a shiny but it deleted because i put out of the lead uh okay well, at least we can't, We got Rimuru, so we could put him in the team. I'm going to roll on him, see if I get anything good on him. So we got Wizard and Range. I think I might keep this. I don't know what Wizard does. I don't. I think it helps Elements, something like that, but I don't really know. So I'm going to keep it for now until uh, I find out what everything does. So yeah, this is the team so far. We have Johi with Unique. I don't even know if Unique is good on her. Uh, I might be roll off that. And yeah, okay, now let's actually do this. Alrighty, alright, alright, alright. Finally got Rimmer on the team. Uh, where exactly does it start? Oh, wait, I think it starts here. Yep, okay. Let's 
go with my boy Rimuru right here. Should be good. I'm gonna place Jolhi right here. Oh, it does 30% more attack. Yeah, we might need another Rimuru here. How is every unit max one placement? Okay. I think I might have to level up these units a bit. I mean, the gameplay is pretty good. The map is pretty big. Uh, I'd give it like a 6 out of 10 so far. Uh, I mean, if the units weren't so fast, maybe it would be doable. Uh, I will have to cheat a little here. I might have to like give my units levels so they could actually kill the units. Uh, but yeah, I'll go through the first map to get to the second map, and I'll be right back when I do that. All right, so I just found out you can get Sid from Planet Namek. So I might try to get him to see how good he is. Uh, I don't know if I'm going to get him this video, but we can just hope. So yeah, there's a new objective now. The objective was clear. We needed to get Sid. So I did as many stories as I did. I completed the whole Namek story, but then I fell asleep. I AFK'd an infinite, and when I woke up, well, I got to record this. I made it to the top three in Namek, and I didn't even notice. What the hell? The hunt for Sid continues. This is already the next day, so I bring a little friend along to help me with this journey. Hi. And after a few hours of grinding and carrying Brian on my back, he decided to appear. I wasn't recording. Oh my god, I just got Sid. Holy crap, we actually got him. Let's go. There was only one thing left to do, and that was to re-roll on Sid. And there's only one trait that Sid deserves, and that is Atomic. But the game had other plans for me. I got Investor like at least five times. I got a bunch of Uniques, but no Atomics. And after just hours and hours of re-rolling, I kind of just gave up. No, there won't be a hype moment right now where I just cut it to where I get it. No. I genuinely gave up because I spent three hours re-rolling and I didn't get anything. I felt like I was playing Souls RNG with the amount of time I just spent standing there trying to get this thing. Alright, so I kind of gave up on getting Atomic on Sid because it's honestly impossible. <sighs> Maybe next time I'll get him, but who knows. Okay, let's let's put him down. Let's put him down. Let's put him down. Let's see how good he is. Alright, we'll take out... Um, Rimuru to see his attacks. Are his attacks the same as Rimuru's? They look the same. Let me up to speed. They look the same as Rimuru. I'm not going to lie to you. Oh, but he slows. Okay, hold up. Okay, he might be cooking here. Yeah, I think he slows. He does slow. Okay, that's actually a W there. All right, all right. By the way, as well, the game just dropped another update. Or, well, another testing update. But they dropped Sung Jin Woo. And I'm not, I might not be getting that this video, but definitely for the next video I do on this game, I will be probably going to be getting Sun Jing Woon. That's if I don't get it beforehand. All right, let me see. I think he has one more upgrade. Okay, so this is his max. Uh, 4,000 damage with 2.73 SPA, 24 range, as well as slow. I think what makes Sid so OP is his slow ability. I don't know how many... How many sids I could place without unique? I'm gonna I'm gonna do that right now after this. So yeah, just give me a minute. All right, so I got the next best thing other than unique, which is golden. So yeah, we'll find out how much is his limit. So we could place down two so far. Three, three. Okay, so three is the max placements for sid. So I think Atomic will probably be the best trait to have on this man. Because Unique, I mean, it wouldn't be the best, as, uh, but it wouldn't, like, okay. So it wouldn't be the worst, but it wouldn't be the best to have Unique on him. So I'd probably get, honestly, I'd probably get Eternal instead of Unique. I feel like it fits him better for now. That's if I get Atomic beforehand. But yeah, oh my god. That is my experience on Universal Tower Defense so far. If you guys enjoyed the video, make sure to hit that like button. Make sure to subscribe as well for more videos like this. And yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one.
Peace.